Dara listening to a warm-up signal coming our way. It's been cold lately. Let's just face yeah, it. Yesterday, sure. I, yeah, yeah. I think the high was 44 degrees. Okay. You know, that's more than 10 below average. We mm -hmm. get most of that back here, but we have probably one more cold blast to deal with before maybe more of a long-duration mild stretch of weather. Okay. So uh, by mm -hmm. the end of the weekend, boy, we're probably going to be right back where we were yesterday, oh. unfortunately. Cold. Yeah, so get ready for this. <laughs> okay. uh, satellite and radar, well, we were focused on a little bit of snow out here in east-central New Mexico yesterday. Uh, the areas we're watching this morning, well, up around Taos, in Rio Ariba County had some weakening rain and snow showers just kind of fizzle on out here in the past couple of hours. Uh, skies stay active to our north and west. More snow around Salt Lake City. And we probably have another batch of snow pushing into the state this afternoon and evening. And then another weather system coming our way on Sunday. Uh, winter storm warning, kind of a long duration deal, still continuing here across the San Juan Mountains of southwest Colorado until 6 on Sunday for a 10 to 18 inch snowfall on top of the mountains. Pretty big stuff. And we also have a winter weather advisor that has spread into the north central part of New Mexico. Uh, Taos, good morning. You're waking up to 28. Santa Fe at 29. Lower 30s right now around the Albuquerque metro. This is where it still is winter cold. That's where we still are seeing the teens and 20s. Las Vegas, Tucumcari, up towards Raton where it is 8 degrees right now. And Raton, your winds aren't calm. We've got a 10 mile per hour wind around Angel Fire. Uh, overall, lighter stuff than yesterday, but still a bit of a wind chill factor. You're back down below freezing in the feels like department for Santa Fe. And look at these single digit feels like numbers. Vegas, Clayton, Tucumcari, feels like 9 degrees this morning in Clovis. So let's open up the view here just a little bit. Still looking at a parade of weather systems and a weather pattern with northwesterly flow just kind of directing them right on into New Mexico. So the snow is going to start to pile up across the northern mountains here in probably the next 24 hours. Let's put some timing on this. Look at the rain and snow showers pushing in this afternoon and evening. Yeah, so by dinner time tonight, we do expect rain showers up around Farmington. It will be snowing in Rio Reba County, also around Taos, maybe a little mix around Santa Fe. In Albuquerque, we're thinking after 6 o'clock, but between 6 and midnight, we could see scattered rain showers and a little bit of a touch of snow on top of the Sandias. Uh, it's kind of a quick little shot of moisture, though, by Saturday daybreak. It's done. It lifts back on up into southern Colorado. And then on Sunday, we have another front dropping south that'll bring the bitter cold back to a big chunk of the state and also snow showers in the forecast for most of us. Uh, between now and uh, tomorrow morning, uh, look at how the snow here. We get into that third or fourth contour of blue here across the San Juans and also over the Sangre de Cristos hitting at least the third color of blue. That means maybe a six inch snowfall. And then we head into Saturday uh, night, Sunday morning. And we don't really add a lot to those snowfall totals, but some purple starting to show up over the San Juan, suggesting, yeah, more than a foot. Of snowfall accumulation. Uh, temperatures up around 50 in the southeast. Yesterday, boy, barely hit freezing, so those numbers are almost 20 warmer. Uh, Rudoso at 57, Alamogordo, you're in the low 60s, and those low 60s are back across the southwest. Maybe one or two high terrain showers for the Gila. It will turn into an awfully wet afternoon and evening here in the Four Corners. Shiprock 51, Farmington 49. Uh, and then we've got southwest Colorado with temperatures in the 40s and a mix of rain and snow showers. I expect some afternoon and evening rain and snow here across the north central mountains. Only about 50 today for Taos and Santa Fe. Northeast New Mexico probably waiting until tonight before just a little bit of this rain and snow pushes through. For the most part, you're going to be waiting until Sunday before another chance of snow. Uh, here we are on the west side of the Sandias. Back up to average, just shy of 60 degrees. Uh, there will be just a touch of an afternoon breeze. And yes, we can't rule out some isolated rain showers. Some high school football games this evening. Uh, could have a wet football out there. A breezy 59 on Saturday, the mild half of the weekend. Sunday, 46 for the high. Uh, it'll be breezy to windy with some scattered snow showers and those chilly temperatures hang out for the first couple days, it looks like, of next week. Todd, Marissa?